Hey everybody, this is Jesse with Nexus 5 Soft Monitor. Today I'm going to show you how to model the status bar on your Nexus 4 after iOS. So assuming that you already have the exposed framework installed onto your Nexus 4 using the links in the full tutorial, you're going to head over to this exposed module using another link in the full tutorial. Once you open that up and download it, you're going to just tap install to install the module, which will only take a couple moments. Once the app is finished, you're going to get a notification saying that the module is not activated, just tap that and you'll go into the exposed installer. You'll check this box to activate it and then you can tap on the module itself to uh, see what kinds of settings you can use. So what's, what this is going to do is this is going to this is going to move the Wi-Fi and the network over to the left side of the status bar. It's a very small and quick easy tweak but it's more in tune to what you'd expect on iOS. You can also um, enable a carrier label and you can set this label to be whatever you want which is kind of a cool feature so once you do that and you have it say whatever you want to say or nothing at all just reboot your device and the changes should be there after you power back on now that the device is powered back on you can see that you've got the Wi-Fi and signal strength and whatever carrier message you have over on the left side of the screen instead of the right um, so again, you can customize this to say whatever you want or nothing at all. You don't have to do that. It's just kind of a cool feature. You can turn this off anytime you want to by going back into the exposed installer and just unchecking that box and then it'll go back to normal, go back to stock settings once you do a reboot. That's it. It's just a quick and simple tweak that you can do. For the full tutorial, check out Nexus 5 Soft Monitor. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks everybody.